Hello everyone! Hi! Welcome to my YouTube channel! Okay, so beberapa minggu lalu, Jasmine ada post dekat Insta Story Jasmine pasal coffee flavor yang korang suka and Jasmine akan challenge macam mana nak buat coffee itu secara senang dekat rumah sendiri. So, coffee tu adalah macam dari Starbucks and a lot of places that you guys send. So, <coughs> I have rounded up five recipes. So, the first recipe that we're going to do today is from the W. Patricia 05 Caramel Latte Affogato Good choice So second option is from NG Shazlinda Thank you Cinnamon Dolce Latte And the third is from my name is M3 Jet Okay, so you have requested my favourite Mocha Coffee the fourth recipe is from Dayang Nurul Shafika Caramel Latte I have made this before and it's really delicious So we're gonna make that today And then Aten, the fifth recipe Then I request Dunkin Donut Iced Coffee Let's try and make a really really nice iced coffee today So let's proceed to our five coffee recipes for today Hey everyone, so welcome to my recipe which is Caramel Latte Affogato And this was requested by UW Patricia05 Okay, untuk um, recipe ni, korang perlukan caramel syrup and then coffee So for Jasmine, sebab I guna Nespresso machine, I'm using this which is ristretto punya flavor But you can use any flavor you want Kalau korang tak ada espresso machine, tak apa, korang boleh guna coffee powder Okay, so Affogato in Italian actually means vanilla ice cream topped with a shot of espresso coffee. So sepatutnya, this should be vanilla ice cream but because I don't have vanilla ice cream and to be honest, I like chocolate ice cream more and I don't want to vanilla ice cream when I'm not going to eat it so I use chocolate ice cream instead. So this is two scoops so let's get started. Hello everyone, so this is my caramel latte affogato. I use chocolate ice cream because I love chocolate ice cream. Let's give it a try because this is apparently a very nice dessert. So, bon appetit! <laughs> oh, this is so good. Mm. Sedapnya, thank you so much for recommending this. Mm. Yeah. This is good, man. This is a good option. Mm, love this. Honestly, I feel like I used the wrong cup, but you know, because it's only like this, so you're supposed to use like that. So presentation-wise, but it's delicious. Hi everyone! So this is the cinnamon dolce latte recipe that Angie Shazlinda has requested. Alright, so first up, you need vanilla extract, whipped cream, milk, cinnamon sticks, white sugar, brown sugar, and because I'm using my Nespresso, so I will be making my coffee via my Nespresso machine. But if you don't have, please feel free to use your coffee powder. Let's get started! All right, so first up is I'm gonna put my white sugar, brown sugar. So sukatan dia boleh ikut suka hati korang. Then I'm going to put with some water. Okay, and then we will just let it caramelize. All right, so it's boiling now. We're going to add cinnamon sticks. And kachow, 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 kachow to caramelize. Next up, you want to add your vanilla extract. Next up is you want to froth your milk, so just boil it up until I think you can see bubble. I'm using my Nespresso machine to make myself the um, Americano. Alright, so this is my coffee. And then if you don't have a espresso machine cup, look again. Koran bole just guna coffee powder. I'm sure it will work out fine. And then next up is to add the cinnamon syrup. So sukahati what um how many sukatanya? Sukahati. And next up I'm gonna add my milk. And next up is my whipped cream. And this you guys is a cinnamon dolce latte. 
And this is the cinnamon dolce latte recipe a la, a la Starbucks. So my presentation is a little bit ugly, but anyway, I'm sure you guys can do a much better and more creative and pretty presentation than me. Bon appetit! <laughs> wow! Not bad! Hey everyone! So we are at our next recipe which is mocha coffee. So for mocha coffee, all you need is milk. Because I am using um, Nespresso, so I use this. And this is the Ispa Inspiracion Frenze, but you can use any flavor you want. And kalau tak ada espresso machine, korang boleh guna any coffee powder that you like, okay? So for this recipe, I'm gonna go with Hershey syrup, which is like the best syrup ever and it, it is um, fat free and also you'll need vanilla extract so let's proceed to our mocha coffee all right so what you want to do now is to actually steam your milk so make it hot and then until they show a little bit of bubble then you can use it already and next up is you want to add two tablespoons of chocolate syrup but you know kalau korang suka chocolate just add however you want to add so I'm adding this much. So for this round, I am going to be using espresso. This is latte, this is Americano, and this is espresso. Push espresso. Actually, this machine, I would have to say it's a very, very good investment, you know, to anybody who loves coffee. Yeah, so this is what I drink every morning or every two days. So this is my chocolate syrup and I'm going to add my espresso and I'm going to add a little bit of vanilla extract <gasps> Oh no, way too much things And then next up is you want to add your steamed milk So this is the mocha coffee Add a little bit of cream and I'm going to add some maple or honey syrup, up to you you can even add cinnamon sprinkles if you want, you know. But yep, here is my mocha coffee. So you guys can mix it or you can choose not to mix it. Up to you. Hi everybody, so this is my mocha coffee. You can use coffee powder if you want, if you don't have an espresso machine. But yes, look at how brown this is. Oh my god, it looks so exciting. I'm going to mix it, but it's up to you guys if you want to mix it. Okay, let's try. Oh my gosh, you put your chocolate syrup is so strong. I love it. I must say this is actually my favorite. Mm. I'm impressed with my recipe. So give it a try. Kalau korang tak ada chocolate syrup, you can use cocoa powder, water and sugar and you can mix it together and make a chocolate syrup. Enjoy! Hi semua, so kita sekarang akan pergi kepada resepi seterusnya iaitu caramel latte. So for caramel latte, you need milk. Uh, Jasmine guna almond and sweetened milk sebab I'm on a diet. But you can use any milk that you want. Coffee, yang ni Jasmine guna coffee powder which is this one. Tapi kalau as usual, if you have espresso machine, you can use the espresso machine. Brown sugar, vanilla extract. So this one, you hanya memerlukan one quarter of a teaspoon and of course caramel syrup you can get any brand you want but i love to use monin let's get to it all right so first up is you want to put in your milk so it's a bit brown now so well i'm reusing the the milk um, from that one and brown sugar and then you heat this up like medium heat so until it simmers like 3 minutes, 2 minutes, like that, okay? And now, um, our milk is already steamed. You want to add in your vanilla extract. So, your knee is just one quarter of a teaspoon. And next up is your caramel sauce. Okay, so it's supposed to be like one tablespoon, but it's up to you, you know. Kalau you suka caramel, you boleh tambah lebih. Tapi kalau you tak suka, you don't have to add them. Alright, so I have boiled, I mean steamed this. I'm just gonna add it to my... You can add more milk, you know, to make it look more interesting. I'm gonna add more milk. I'm gonna steam more milk, guys. I've added some whipped cream. Yummy, yummy. 
look at this it's so pretty this is my caramel latte and can you believe it like this is made by a coffee powder which uh, you know you can buy from the supermarket and they're not expensive and you can have a Starbucks caramel latte at home okay now let's see whether it tastes nice or not mm. Whoa! Mm, not bad, to be honest, right? Actually, I think it tastes like my other <laughs> um, espresso coffee. It's really good. Sedap, sedap, sedap yang tak terkata. So, do give this a try. This is caramel latte. By um, your request, Dayang Nur Shafika. Hey everyone, so I'm going to be making iced coffee which is requested by Athen. For this, we need milk. Kat recipe, they want kata half and half and half and half itu adalah cold milk and light cream mix. But you can just use milk, normal milk. And this is my normal milk. Coffee, which I use coffee powder. Sugar, I use brown sugar but you can use white sugar up to you. And vanilla extract. So let's get on to it. So first step is to add some water. Ini adalah pan yang Jasmine guna tadi. So don't add so much. Just a pan a bit too much. So put this inside here. And then after that, you want to add your sugar. So now you want to add sugar. And then you can add in the vanilla extract once it's simmer. This is half a teaspoon, but you can add more if you want. Or your syrup that you've just made. Hi everyone, so this is my iced coffee, um, Dunkin' Donuts style. So if you guys want it too much um, lagi hitam, uh, you don't have to add milk, but I add milk for this. So if not, um, you don't have to um, add milk, then it will be iced black coffee with syrup. Mm, I like it. Not too sweet, macam coffee yang you beli dekat, you know those old, old shops, you know, yang dia punya coffee is so strong. So, this is good. I really, really like this. And I think the difference between letak sugar straight and kalau you buat syrup, I rasa kalau you buat syrup, dia ada lagi banyak kick. And I just realized in all my recipes, there's vanilla extract. So, that's quite weird. I don't know if that's like the secret recipe for all coffees. So, yeah. <laughs> anyway, enjoy my iced cup of coffee. So there you have it everyone. These are all my selections of coffee. Ding, 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 ding. So uh, if you guys macam nak eksperimen dekat rumah on these coffee recipes, do uh, try them at home because they're not too expensive and then you can get the bahan-bahan daripada supermarket. So if you guys are trying it out, kalau korang ada Instagram, well don't forget to take a photo and tag me to know that you've tried my coffee recipe challenge dekat rumah juga. So thank you for watching my channel. Wishing you guys all the best. Stay safe. And don't forget to like, subscribe and comment and share. Um, bye everyone! Selamat tinggal! <laughs>